What is going on fellow Pokemon card collecting enthusiasts? This is Jay Scotty Sun back with another Pokemon video. And in this video, I have a 168 card return from PSA. They are in these boxes right here. And I am very excited. This submission was 20 bucks a card. It was sent out March 2nd of 2021. So it has been 16 months for this submission to get back. So yeah, I'm very excited to get back into it. Uh, if you didn't know already, if you're not subscribed to the channel, feel free to do that. And you also should also know that I do not check the grades of my submissions. So this is my genuine reaction to what I have here in these boxes. Uh, first one is now open and I do kind of like these new boxes that PSA has right here. If you didn't know, PSA got new boxes uh, and I'm pretty stoked on them. I will say that I am stoked on them. All right, so let's set up a good set up a good tempo here uh, for the first box. First up, we got a Dark Dragonite. Let's go. There's a lot of scratches on this one. I'm gonna guess a seven. Hey, let's go. Good, good guess right off the gate. I just did in a lot of Japanese cards, but these are not them. This one might get a seven as well. Gets a six. Huh. Looks similar to that other Dragonite. Dark Alakazam getting the Mint 9. Let's go. Dark Slow Slowbro getting the Near Mint to Mint 8. So we're going with Team Rocket to start things off. Never mind, we're back into Fossil. This might get a 9 even though there's that Nick right there. Gets the 8. How's everybody's day going? How's everybody's uh, Monday? <laughs> Black Star Promo, this one doesn't look too hot. Gets the 8. Yeah, sending that in at $20 a card, not a wise decision. It's gotta be some more minty stuff here. Eight. This one looks pretty nice. I'm gonna guess a nine out of that. There we go. And it is the uh, Cosmos foil from the Thunder deck, Thunderstorm theme deck. Maybe we can get some, some tens thrown in every now and then. There's a nine there as well on the other uh, Thunderstorm theme deck Zapdos. Dragonite getting an 8. Man, my last return was great. I had a bunch of EX cards uh, thrown in in the 9 pile there. Raichu. This one looks pretty nice. I think it's a 9. It's an 8. Wonder why. So just the uh, lighting here for you guys. I always forget to look at the uh, frame of the video that I'm shooting and because I'm just focused on the cards here but I really should look at the frame of the video this one's got to get a nine right there we go next up some muck gem in ten no nope. muck gem in ten no <laughs> but it would be nice to see that nine pile grow a lot larger uh, over the span of this video six Ooh, not too good muck it's a non-hollow muck. Throw it in at $20 a card. What was I thinking back then? I was thinking Pokemon was going to the moon. That's what I was thinking back in March of 2021. Couldn't make any wrong moves back then. Nice. That's pretty cool. See that. Grab another random box here. I'm not sure exactly how many parts this video is going to be. With 168 cards, it could go up to three parts. There we go. Man, it's just holding on by a, a single thread there, or what? There we go. Okay, more than one thread. Looking like a, a rookie here with these new boxes that PSA has now. Maybe it's this. There we go, that's what I need to be doing. Sweet. Then it just comes right out. Alright, we got some Japanese stuff, so hoping for some gems. Especially with the fossil stuff that I opened up myself on the channel. If you didn't know, I opened up quite a lot of fossil packs on the channel. 30 or so. This is looking minty. Let's go. Seven. Why? Look at that. It looks terrific. Nah, maybe there is something down there. Alright. 
Let it slide, PSA. <laughs> this time, Eric is Venusaur. There's a lot of whitening there on the top. Gets a six. Cedra, Misty's Cedra gets another six. Ouch. There's some whitening on the top of this. Gets the eight. That one didn't look like an eight from the top. Electabuzz getting a seven. Man. Blades Moltres getting the eight. A six. Ugh. Not feeling too great about this submission so far. This one doesn't look good either. Gets a seven. These are all going to go straight to auction at some point. I don't see any reason why I'd keep most of these. Seven sevens. Okay, Rockets me too. Let's. Oh, there's a dent right there. Hey, get some at nine. What about that dent, everybody? Let's see if I can uh, zoom in for you guys. Check out that dent. That's a straight up dent. So this is a week. A week nine could have been could have happened while they were sonically sealing the card, but I'll take it. I'll take a nine. Electabuzz getting a seven. So a lot of a lot of mid grades, a lot of near mint, near mint to mint, but not a lot of nines coming through on this submission thus far, and zero tens. Oh. Hopefully, okay, maybe this could get a, snag us a ten, huh? Gets the nine. The, the sevens, eights, and nines are all tied up right now. Blaine's Moltres coming in with an eight. Let's see, I messed up the angle of the camera. There we go. Machamp, six. Dark Gyarados getting a seven. All right, let's choose a better box, shall we? This one doesn't look like it has as much tape on it. There we go. Probably make this the last stack and really draw out this whole entire <laughs> submission into three videos. Or maybe just make a fast one of video number two. Because we're already at over seven minutes. Vileplume looks pretty clean on the front. Looks pretty clean on the back. Gets a seven. All right, sorry, gets a nine. Nice. Vaporeon would like to see this in a 10, wouldn't you? Gets the eight. Venomoth, probably a seven. Hey, gets an eight. Maybe there's like a whole jungle set up here. First edition, gonna think it's gonna get a nine. There we go. Snorlax, they, that's not gonna get a nine. Eight. Victory Bell, let's go with a nine. Let's go. Norlax, this one's maybe a six. There we go. At least I was right with the grade. Not happy with the grade, but happy I got right. I'm gonna guess a six. Eight, okay. It's not often I'm up two grades off. Scyther, I'm gonna guess a six. Seven. Scyther, another seven? Five, first five of the video. Another Scyther, seven. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta think these these scythers were going for ninety dollars and a seven, so I was like twenty dollars to grade it, might as well. Nice, got a mint nine there. Pincer, another mint nine. I need that in the first edition nine. It's another one. Gets another nine. Those are worth submitting. This Pidgeot was not worth submitting. What about this Pidgeot? It was worth submitting. What about this one? Looks pretty good besides the print lines. Seven. Last card. Look at those print lines. Those are significant. I'm gonna guess a seven from this. Yeah. All right, that's it for the video, everybody. Uh, stay tuned for part two. It'll be up Tuesday, which is tomorrow. Have a great Monday, and see y'all on the next episode of the PSA submission return of 168 cards. Peace out. Thank you.